Hi, this is Matt, and this is a video on creating an application password in WordPress. So why might you need an application password on WordPress? Uh, I'll just give you one use case. Uh, it's useful for a lot of different things. Maybe you're creating a Python script and you're doing some sort of uh, feature where you need to auto-update things on a number of different WordPress posts and you're using a Python script to do that. Super simple, easy way to actually do that quickly and at scale. Uh, so you, you will need uh, an application password for that. So this video will just show you how to actually uh, create an application password uh, password even in your WordPress backend. Uh, if you need any information from WordPress itself, we've got this article here, which I'll put in the uh, description just below this video. This just kind of goes through what an application password is, uh, what you might need it for, and uh, some troubleshooting you know, if you get into any trouble. So uh, as far as getting this application password, what you need to do, so, I'm on my WordPress backend right here. So you'll need to actually go into your user profile. So on this, uh, I've got a lot open here on this sideboard, uh, this sidebar, there's a lot going on. But what you're going to do is you're going to click on users and actually click on uh, the user profile that you want to add the app password on. So I've just skipped right down here to the section that you'll find here, application passwords. I don't want to show too much of this profile just for privacy reasons. Uh, as far as other things on there that might be uh, a little bit risky to show privacy wise. So uh, you'll just need to come all the way down once you've opened up the user uh, profile in question, uh, you need to come down to application passwords right here. So all we're going to do is we're going to set a name for this particular application password. So maybe we want to call it update, uh, just as an example. So now we just click on the add new application password button right here. And after just a little bit of time, we've now got this password right here. So you'll get this, I think it's 24 characters long. Uh, there's some spaces built in here as well. And that is your application password. So all you're gonna do is you're going to copy that one uh, and you'll be able to use that in your Python scripts wherever you need it, whether you're using the REST API of WordPress or uh, any other reason you can use this application password. So if you're creating a script, somewhere maybe using ChatGPT to create a script uh, when it requests the application password. This is the one you need. Uh, put that one in and you have your application password all ready to go. And you can of course revoke here. I'm going to revoke these just after this video is completed because obviously I don't want to have this publicly displayed for any reason. And yeah, hopefully you have found that useful. This was a very short, straightforward video on creating an application password in WordPress. Yeah.